Zeldi Cooking. Today I am very very excited to say that we are making a best thing which is called Bhel Pizza. It's, don't you think it's tempting? Okay, let's see what we need for that. Main ingredient for this which we are going to use for a like a pizza base is this these are rice crackers these are rice crackers you get it like this these are my lightly salted rice crackers okay and these are like what we eat like the mumra vagarela mumra it's like that see how crispy it is see you see the sound these are very crispy See, you feel a crunchy sound and this is what we are going to use for a bale pizza. These are made from mamra. Just a mamra and pinch of salt inside. Okay, these are store made. For the topping, what we need is, it's a simple like what we use for a bale. Okay, I have taken chopped tomatoes, boiled corn, uh, boiled potato, then save. If you have a dahlia at home, so these are a dahlia which I got it from store. Chopped coriander leaves, chopped onion and chopped cucumber. Okay and what I need is for that mithi chutney and tikhi chutney. So these are my tikhi chutney and a mikhi chutney which you can check it in my videos how to make it. And the, what we need is a chaat masala. So this is a chaat masala. This is what we need for the topping. You can use whatever you have at home. It's very simple and very interesting. So let's start making it. I'm making it into two types. This bale pizza. First let's spread the sweet chutney. That's a mitha chutney which I have made from dates and turmeric. So let's spread that on it. And equally spread all over. Okay. Now spread it like what you spread like a pizza sauce. The same kind, same way. Now I am spreading mitikhi chutney. That's my spicy green chutney which I have made from coriander leaves and spinach. So spreading that. Looks so nice, right? And now whatever topping you have it in the house. Okay, now let's first put the tomato. Okay, we'll first add tomato slices. Chop tomato, chop potato, the same way you make your bale. Okay, so now some corn. Okay, now cucumber. Okay, looks good. And some onion. Okay, and this is chana dal. Some chana dal on top of it. Okay, and lots of save in place of a cheese. Right, looks so tempting. And you can add as much you want and some coriander leaves in the end. Okay. So this our pizza bale is ready to eat. Don't you think it looks tempting? Now I am making into the second type, the different style. Mix everything in a one bowl. I am taking potatoes, tomatoes, now my sweet corns. Okay, take the sweet corns. Now I am taking onion. Now cucumber, okay so first what we are mixing, mix all the salad item together, okay now time to spread our mithi chutney, now spread the mithi chutney on it, do it equally on the surface, okay the same way spread the tikka coriander chutney. These are green spicy chutney and as I said you can check it on my video how to make it. Now instead of doing separately all the topping just place it like this. So you don't have to 
go on adding separately okay so this stopping is done now you have to add whatever you want i'm adding my chana dal and save and lots of coriander leaves on it and i forgot to add this you can always add your chaat masala sprinkle some chaat masala on it okay sprinkle the chaat masala so our two bell are ready to eat don't you think it looks so interesting so now our bell bell pizzas are ready so don't you think it looks very tempting and interesting make it when you, when you have a friends or a guest at home they will enjoy it's a total different kind instead of eating bell in the regular form this is in the like a pizza form they will enjoy it and now i'm ready to try let me try it do you hear a crunchy sound it's very yummy please do try and make sure when you make it eat it in a few minutes immediately otherwise it will become soggy thank you for watching and please do try and check my other recipes